OMG guys. There was a leak today in Wings of Fire and uh, uh, we get a map of Petella. Petella is is released. Not only that, but we know the abilities of the other tribes and, and, and everything. Pentella is officially here. Pentella is here. Pentella, Pentella, oh my gosh. I'm like freaking out. Oh my gosh. There is so much to talk about, you guys. I'm, I'm, I felt like screaming earlier when I saw this. These are the tribes. Oh, well, obviously, Silk Wings. We already knew about these guys. We didn't know their abilities, but we knew these were one of the tribes. There's two more, and then I'm going to look some stuff up um, showing the uh, abilities that these dragons have, the characters, and the protagonist um, it, that, you know, is blue is a male, not a female, fortunately. So there's blue, or Silk Wing. This is a Leaf Wing. These guys are known to be extinct. This is the tribe. And there's reasons why, and I have many theories. I absolutely love this. I mean, look at this tribe. Look at it. Look at the patterns, the wings, and everything. This dragon is beautiful. And I don't know if I would want to be a leaf wing, but they, they look gorgeous. And then this tribe is my favorite. In Pentella, this is a hive wing. They're based off of wasps. Wasps. Uh, yeah, that's better. And, um, yeah, this dragon is amazing. This dragon is all about poison. It's like the most poisonous tribe. Like, even deadlier than a rain wing. I think the rain wings have the deadliest venom, but these guys have a lot of venom on them, even way more than a sand wing. So if a sand wing and a hive wing won in a battle, I think we would suspect that the hive wings would win this is poison jungle here this is the head there's yellow jacket hive wasp wasp hive to stay hive vingarin hive hornet hive jewel hive kikata hive mantis hive and bloodworm hive there's a lake scorpion um then there's beetle lake and that's Pentella. Now you can see here that this is obviously demonstrating a dragon with the head, the legs, the tail, the body, and then the wings. I do not have a picture of Pyria, um, but where this this is a big deal, you guys. So hold on, you look something up. Wings of Fire, book 11. Now, there's so many theories I can put on this. And there are 301 pages, by the way, just so you guys know. And, um, hold on, everybody, come on, let me get there. Okay. Here's when I find the last continent. Book number 11, 301 pages, comes out June 26, 2018. Points of view is clear sight. Well, that's a prologue. Protagonist is blue. Epilogue is Luna. And we find out that Luna is actually the dragon that appears in Jerboa's hut. That's her. And so, father, admiral, mothers, burnet, silver spot, biological, half brother, blue. This is obviously blue. Under six years, just under six years, gender, male, tribe, silk wings, resonance, pantella, sidatic hive, let's see what that is. It says the sidatic hive is one of the multiple hives on pantella, is the home of blue and luna, as well as multiple other silk wings and hive wings. Now let's see these hive wings. Hive wings are one of the three tribes that are live on pantella, blah, blah, blah. Pause this and read. Abilities. It says, according to Pentella Dragon Guide, the high wings' powers can vary from dragon to dragon. Deadly stingers extending from their wrists, venom in their claws and teeth, paralyzing toxin, boiling acid that can be shot from barb, 
on their tail are a few examples. A few examples? Wow, this, this dragon is all about dead, deadly. This dragon is deadly. Stay away from it. Um, known high wings. No, not gallery hat. Known high wings. Queen wasp. Tur. Older than 50 years. Okay, gender female. Chad high wings. I get the feeling that this is going to, like, go to battle. Um, occupation. Queen of the high wings and silk wings. Okay, special powers. My control over all high wings except cr cricket. Wow, that's crazy. And then relatives, cricket, help, okay, cricket is this, this, um, high wing, resident, special, special, special powers, residents to queen wasps, mind control, female, and let me look up silk wings, gorgeous. Blah, blah, blah. Abilities. Silk wings above the age of six can fly and shoot silk from their wrists. A rare subset of the latter power is flame silk. Not much is known about this ability besides that Luna Admiral and likely Blue has it. Man, that, okay, that's crazy. Known silk wings. Whoa, 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 whoa. What? 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 Queen Monarch. Who is this? Queen Monarch was the last queen of the silk wings who ruled about 50 years ago during the tree wars. What's the tree wars? Okay, the tree wars were an event about 50 years ago that took place on Pantella. All that's known is that the leaf wings were threatened. Threatening the rest of the tribes, and in the war, they were wiped out. After the war, Queen Ross cut down all the old leafwing trees, supposedly preventing them from returning. Okay, so they threaten the rest of the tribes, so maybe that's why Queen Wasp is the ruler. See, there's got to be a reason for this. Leafwings. Script nobilities. It says leafwings are able to absorb sunlight. They have, are said to have been accomplished gardeners and it is rumored some had unusual control over plants no leaf wings queen sequoia maple sundew who's sundew female leaf wings book of oh she appears in lost content okay she helped cricket in blue okay that's crazy this is amazing okay so blue is a silk wing i'm i'm thinking we're going to have cricket as a point of view because she's clearly helping cricket in blue and then it 